Hello, my name is Devani, and thanks so much for tuning into Short Not Sweet. This week, I want to talk about the 2023 shoe trends that I'm excited about, especially sandals, but I will get into some other things as well. I'm going to be talking about designer, affordable, in between. I'm going to be giving you some dupes as well. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, and the first thing I want to talk about are like crystal embellished sandals. Um, Prada has a pair of crystal embellished dad sandals. I did mention them a couple of videos ago. I saw them in the Prada flagship store here in New York City. Um, they had like a black satin sandal with white crystals, but I finally seen them on the Prada website they also come in like a black crystal they are ridiculously priced I think they're around 1850 I'll put it up all I'll put up all the prices on the screen um, so it's just a stupid price Prada has no respect for us they are completely ridiculous but I love these sandals so much um, and another brand that has these crystal embellished like dad sandals Gucci has their own version theirs is like a mesh dad sandal and then it has the Gucci GG's and these crystals they also Gucci has a like a sling back with that same like a similar design there um, I think those are around $8.95 so about half the price of the Prada ones but still expensive so walk with me Staud S-T-A-U-D also has a version of those crystal embellished dad sandals um, and those are a lot cheaper. I think they're two something, not $20, I get it, but they're fabulous and they give you that really crystal embellished dad sandal look for a fraction of the price of the Prada ones. So a couple of options there. Another thing I'm super into are like sandals with that wrap around the ankle detail. Renee Cavalier is well known for that. Um, you might have seen that I own the Renee Cavalier Clio boots, but they also make the Renee Cavalier Clio style, which is that wrap around style in like heels. That's not really my style, but they have them in flat sandals as well. Oh my goodness. Uh, and they come in a plethora of colors. I've also seen them in like a metallic, so like an old gold version. Those Renee Cavill is not cheap though, girl. So those retail for around $1,700, I think, but they do go on sale. So you can, you know, shop around and find them. There's also, if you want like a little bit of lift, Renee Cavill makes those with like a little bit of like a block heel. So that's also a good option. But wait, there's more. I have <laughs> I have another option for you because Steve Madden makes a version of these for around 99 of bucks. And Steve Madden, you know she always has a sale. So you might want to check back and find those. I'm going to try to link as many things as I can below. Um, and if you're into that style, but maybe you want more options, eight a brand called Ancient Greek Sandals. They also make this wraparound style in a flat sandal. And it comes in like, I don't know, like metallics, duo chromes, just so many options. And those retail for, I don't remember, but I'm gonna be putting that up on the bottom. Really a fraction of the Renee Cavalier's one. Renee Cavalier one, so you definitely have options here. Now, next, I don't know if Gladiator sandals are in, but that's none of my business. I want a pair of Gladiator sandals. I have been excited about them for a while. Um, I don't know if you remember back in the day, we were super into Gladiator sandals. We were walking around looking like Russell Crowe or something. We were killing it, okay? And I wanna do that again. Um, I really need me some uh, Gladiator sandals. And I've been looking at some by a brand called Ash. Um, and they make them in so many options. You can ha have them like higher up on the leg, lower down on the leg. You can have them where they have they buckle up just with regular buckles. You can have them, sometimes they have them with like a little zip on the side with a little cute little tassel. They have like silver little studs all over them, gold little studs all over them. Um, they usually come in like neutrals, like black, brown, um, and like a light tan, maybe like a white. Um, so they have those kind of options. I also saw them in like a burgundy, but I haven't seen two, haven't seen those as widely available. Now those retail for around 200, 225. You can find them cheaper. I've seen them on Amazon as well for around 100. So shop around for those as well if you're into them. But if you're looking for a cheaper version, Steve Madison, he has got you. Steve Madden girl has a has a pair, and they look really similar um, to the Ash ones. They're around 40 bucks. Um, I think I saw them on like Rack Room Shoes. Again, I'll link them below. I also saw a different pair. They didn't have like studs all over them, but they had like that Gladiator style. Um, and they were by Shoots, Shoots Shoes, I think. And they retail for around 125. And they like kind of like laced up a little bit. They were really cool. And in this really cute, like, like brownish, caramelish color, if you're in the market for that. So uh, again, everything's linked below. Now, another trend that I've been seeing is metallics. Of course, we know metallics have been trending for a while now. Metallic boots, you know, we all have been having a good time with that. Um, and I think that's going to continue into the spring and summer here. And I've seen a lot of cute sandals with that metallic trend on them. I saw a pair by a brand called LaRoot. LaRoot, I think. 
Um, and it was like all like very, it's a flat sandal, very strappy, all silver, very cute. Um, I don't remember how much that cost, but I will put the price below. Uh, I also saw some really cute flats. These aren't sandals, but I said I would mention some other cute shoes for the summer. And they're by Simone Roca. I think I'm saying that right. I'm so sorry if I'm getting that wrong. I will try to get it together. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, but Simone Roca has these flats and they come in like these delicious, delightful colors. They're like fluorescent fluorescent orange fluorescent green just very cool perfect for summer if you want like a closed toed shoe I think they even had like some strap detailing on them just I'm not too into flats but those are kind of special you know so I really you know I wanted to recommend those as well another trend was chunk all kinds of chunks so much chunkiness so you know we love we, we're really still into those chunky heels chunky boots and you have a lot of options and sandals as well um, a couple of options here the celine sandals with the celine logo straps and everything those are an oldie but goodie from a couple of seasons ago and they're still going strong they still have me in a chokehold you know i don't really need another uh logo pair of sandals but i want them I really want them. And they have this like lugged heel that is so good to me. I just love them so much. Um, another option are wedges. So Fendi makes these really cute wedges. We saw them in boots as well, but then they make this wedge. They look like they're made of like plastic, like a shiny plastic. I don't know what the hell those things are made of, but they are so cool. And then they have like the Fendi first F on them. I just obsessed with them so much and they come in like such like fun kind of pastel -y colors just ridiculous absolutely love those another option is Dries Van Noten Dries Van Noten is making like platform flip-flops I think they've been making these for the past couple of seasons I saw them like covered in like florals they have like a little heel just very interesting if you like chunk and you want some interesting detailing Dries has got you um, another option is Max Mara if you want something more streamlined you know Max Mara is a little cleaner and you want like a beautiful leather platform flip-flop Max Mara has got you they have got you now I'm not sure on the price on those but I'm sure they're pricey but you know they're cute you know they're cute <laughs> and then another trend um, is just jelly jelly everything you remember the jellies from back in the day those clear um sandals with little to no arch support girl we were wearing them and we love them and they're back but this time for whole ass adults okay i don't know why but that's what we're doing um gucci has a version and those look basically like the ones we had on when we were kids just with like maybe some ggs in a couple places again I don't know, girl, but that's what the girls are giving this season. I don't know what to tell oh, you. And then another one pair that I actually really like is Tori Burch makes some slides, uh, which I feel is more practical for this jelly trend. And they come in like these delicious, juicy colors, like like a lime green. I think there was a pink. I'm not sure. Just and you know, Tori Burch is at a, a more decent price point. Uh, so I just think that was also a more practical, but also really fun option. Um, and also I have to mention heels. I'm not very into heels, but sometimes, you know, when I'm getting dressed, I do find myself saying, damn, I really need a pair of heels that will really elevate literally this outfit. Um, and so I wanted to shout out two brands that I've been kind of having my eye on for potential, you know, brands that I would purchase heels from. And the first one is Awake Mode. Awake Mode makes these, I don't even know, they're like asymmetrical, like square toed heels where like your toe is in, but the other four toe, your, excuse me, your big toe is in this leather encasement, but the other four toes are just hanging out there breathing freely. And then the strap comes back and wraps a little bit around your ankle. Now the heel is a little bit high for me, maybe about, I don't know if it's a, like two and a half, three inches or whatever. I don't even know if it's that high. Um, but any heel is really too high for me. I'm just not that girl. Uh, but they're so cute and they're so different. They come in so many different colors. You can get them in black. I saw one that was like black and tan, just like, you know, contrasting and very cute. I've seen them in like metallics, like a gold. I think I might've seen them in a print, like just very interesting. You're not gonna see them all over the internet. And Awake Mode, again, it goes on sale and it's not priced crazily. Like you're not gonna have to break the bank on those. So I think those are a really good option if you're looking for an interesting pair of heels for the summer season. Another brand I wanted to talk about was Cult Gaia. And Cult Gaia, man, they also have a pair of heels that uh, do the wrap around your, your, um, your leg thing. Uh, but the the actual heels that they make, like some of their heels, 
are like little crystal balls. Like they just have so many different options. I saw one pair. They kind of they were kind of reminiscent of like the I think they're YSL cage booties from way way back in the day. Um, I can't explain it. That's why I'm gonna go ahead and put up a damn picture, okay? <laughs> and then they're really strappy in the front, and they were this metallic gold, so beautiful. So there are so many options. I'm really excited. Summer is my favorite season, so I can't wait to get into these. Um, tell me, what shoes are you excited to break out that you already own? And what shoes do you have on your wish list for the spring, summer? I really want to know. Uh, hopefully this video was fun. If it was, maybe you consider liking this video and subscribing to this channel. You can also check me out at shortnotsweet.com as well as on TikTok and Instagram at shortnotsweetdevany. Thank you so, so much for watching and please, please take care of yourself. Bye.